Yep, she's off with the stone. Oh. <laughs> no warmers under that. She says, yes, there is. <laughs> what a crazy dog. We're going down the beach one more time. This will probably be the last trip of the year, I'd expect. Uh, we're more going for a bit of a look around today. We are, yeah. See if we can get you some footage of different things. Now there is another tide right at the end of April and it's uh, it's a right tide. It's not going to be a, as big as some of the other tides that have been. But um, we'll see about going on that because we'll be doing a lot of boat stuff by then so we probably won't. Although if it's a really nice day we might take a walk. But getting back today let's go and see if we can find some goodies some interesting things yeah some interesting things right, well we're just walking out to our mark and i just spotted that the grandpappy of ormers i'll turn you you've got upside down for a second but there it is in there what a monster right i've got my dinner <laughs> Look at it! That's a full on half a pound steak right there. That would weigh about half a pound actually. When they get to that size they normally weigh about half a pound. What a monster. You can see though how it looks just like the rock. That's why it doesn't get spotted. What a find! <laughs> An absolute belter. Lovely. There's the one we just found just in the crevice over there it's a bit windy at the moment but now we did actually find a really big one a minute ago I don't know if I've shown that I might have done if not you'll see it at the end it was just walking around in the open right let's get moving giant but it's all right yeah I'll put that one there I'm gonna leave that one it might be size but it won't be much oversized that's size your knife might be better <laughs> there we go. It's not a bad one. It's a long one, eh? Mm -hmm. See where it scratches its shell yeah. so tight in the hole. <sighs> Great big sea anemone in there. Inside that cavey area. Just found a little under the rock here. Rebecca's going to gauge it, but it's probably too small. Probably won't bother with that one. Yeah, yeah. Just pop the rock over it. It just rolled up on its edge. Yeah. It's probably around the size limit, but we're putting them back. We're looking for the big ones today. 
that's what we're after. It's the big stuff. Yeah. Scallop shell. Unfortunately, no scallop. Right. Rebecca's requested an armoring hook because she's turned pro now. So, <laughs> she's pro armor hunter. So it's a nice good, but when you get those ones stuck in the holes, you need the hook to be able to get them out. Right, let's get going again. There's actually two in here. One, two. This is, how you, this is how you get almost. Just keep putting your hook in and find them. Right, I'll have to check them, but they're probably small, small. And that was probably big enough, but whether we'll take it, I don't know. Yeah, look at that. As a... And there was another one stuck to him there, but it fell off. Yeah, there's a starfish yeah. there with, a, with an almost stuck to it. Yeah, and that one was and with that it. One. But it fell off, so yeah. it's attacking as the arch enemy of the Orma. Yeah, and I get that off of there. You'll have to find something else for dinner. I thought I had the camera off, but I didn't. I just pulled that rock there. Big rock, I tell you. But we had these three, so quite pleased about that. They're all size. I'm gonna call Rebecca over so she can have a look at this. Because this is fantastic when you get a hole full of almonds like that. We'll hook them out, sure. I think at the moment there's about five in there. I think every one is big. And they're big, and yeah. on the other side, there's more. Wow. So, do you want to have a go at getting them out? Yep. We practice with the uh, hook. Get that bottom one first. Right. Yeah, you'll get those out. So take my hook and try and get them out. Camera's rolling on you, by the way. Oh, and there's another one a bit further off there. So that's another two. Oh, keep looking around. Thank you. 
this one around the side will be easy for you. This one around here. Just, just pop them there, we'll show the camera in a minute. I'm going to go and get another one that I found over here. I'll catch my breath, I've just been able to get another one, which is that one there, a bit further up. But that is all the ones that were in that hole. Awesome. Six ormers there. So, brilliant. Right, let's get... It's certainly not been discovered for a while. No, nobody's been out here. I can no. say you don't get out here. It's only this tide that you're going to get onto this rock. But that's perfect, that is. Get them once you get it over as well. Three beauties under that rock. The size of them. Oh, it's getting to that time that we're going to finish. Now that was a nice rock. Yeah. Some of these will be stuck in the sand, you see. Until you lift them, you see, because they're always like. Right, no, one more on the way back. Nice. Yeah, knife it off that one. Oh, I was that you would, Any luck? One. 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 Yeah. I'm going to give him a couple. Give him these two then, here. Yeah. Right, these two? Couple more to go with them. Oh, yeah. Here, then. Where's my bucket? Where's your bucket? Never go anywhere without your bucket. <laughs> you make a fine meal. A fine casserole. The size of that one, that's got to be the first one we found. That is. That, that is a giant. We haven't shown that one yet, actually. No. Yeah. Because we said we'd do it when we got home, and there it is. Look at it. Look at it. Look at it. That is huge. Turn it over. You get a good look at that foot. Look at that yeah. foot. That's a Wait meal on its own, that's, right? That's a meal on its own. Oh, look at that. Twelve and a half. Well, no, it doesn't break any records, but that is that is your maximum one you'll find. Yeah, 12 and a half centimetres, that one. Shell doesn't look too bad. We'll show you in a minute, because all the others in there are pretty big. We've got a few mediums as well, but we'll put, we'll put that on top, like yeah. that. There you have them. And the biggest one right on the top. You can see the size difference compared to the others. That's like I say, that's a 12 and a half centimetre. That's kind of what I aim for, the biggest ones. I'd like to try and get above 13, but they are so rare. I don't often see them that quite that big. But uh, Great day.